Hey love bugs, it's Riles, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And for my returning subs, my extended family, thank you so much for the love and support. We are growing like crazy. And I am so appreciated to that. And I to that and I'm feeling so blessed and so grateful it's just more and more people are gravitating towards us and you know more people are getting comfortable with you know sending out love and light and that's a really good thing that's a really good blessing that you know just to see that and experience that every day and so you know for that I am so grateful for that from the bottom of my heart I love you so much and for that being said namaste much love to all much love and light and many blessings and many blessings are yet to come for you and I know I messed that up but I apologize <coughs> and if you've been watching my my videos for a while and have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video and if you feel like you are comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the positive feedback of the video or you just tell me about your impact and gift that, you know, the universe is placed upon. Or if you feel like that, you know, my videos just really gave you some clarity and, you know, put you in some good vibes, you know, spread the love. Don't be stingy. Stay, spread, share the love. But give me a thumbs up. Like it, even share. You know, it's all greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for coming to my channel today. And the beautiful, peaceful meditation music I'm listening to right now is relaxing music for stress relief. Native American flute, violin, cello, harp, music, uh, piano music, uh, star 142. And I'll post that link in the description box below. It's very peaceful too, and it shows like the wilderness and the ocean, and it's just so beautiful. It's very beautiful, especially if you like to see nature, you know, the pictures on nature, you know, because I usually put it on my big screen and I'll see it, and it just looks very pretty when I'm really wanting to meditate. But yes, my video today is about Twin Flame 101. All empaths on a jump start. We're all on a path to a jump start. Let me turn this down a little bit. We're all on a path to a, um, to a jump start. You know, because a lot of us, we're not all blessed to be exactly where we want to be right now. We're probably in a house that we don't want to be in. We're driving a car we don't want to be in. We're out of job for number one with all the things we don't want to be in. We always have to be blessed because we can be... You know, it can be far worse than what it is. You have to think, you know, even though sometimes we're at a job, you know, like I've been hearing y'all, y'all been laughing like, oh my God, y'all telling me, you telling my story, Rosalind, for the day at my job. You know, y'all got to be saying Hail Marys. I mean, I don't see it on Facebook. We're going to show folks rolling up fat joints before they go into their job, drinking liquor, taking shots of liquor. I mean, I haven't seen folks at work doing that. And I'll bust out laughing. I'll say anything, as long as you don't get hurt, anything to get you through. If you ain't hurting me or you hurting nobody else and you ain't hurting yourself, do whatever floats your boat, as long as you don't get in trouble for it or get caught. <laughs> get caught. So just remember, be grateful for where you're at because it always can be worse because there's so many people that would be begging for that raggedy ass car you in. You know, mine's sweet. You know, I was like, there's some folks that's out here in this hot sun that's walking around and wish they had my little squeaky car. <laughs> okay? So I don't be tripping about stuff like that. You know, you be complaining about that job. There'll be somebody sitting up here begging for that daggone job you complaining about. So it's just always number one, be grateful for where you're at because it can always be far worse than you you know you can ever imagine trust me it always is and sometimes we don't want to hear that but we have to you know just to get us through the day you have to be able to psych yourself out like that <laughs> you know people be asking me Rosa what do you do I psych myself out I psych myself out you know I'm out exactly where I want to be right now but when 
you have to learn patience and i just talked about that in my last video we have to yeah you know i mean because there could be jobs where you know you just running from folks because they complain all the time and it's just like Man, I ain't even trying to be here today. Be well enough alone listen to your mouth fussing or whatever. You just got to stay away from folks like that. Because I remember I used to be around this one woman. Even though I didn't like my job. Like if I was talking to my friend girl, you know, we'll, we'll talk amongst each other. But I'm just not going to go to each and every person that I know at my job and be complaining. Because that that'll be how mess gets started. Especially if they know you don't like the job and they figure out that you don't like it. They're going to make sure they let the boss know so they can eddy up on you to make their self look good. So they can make the job easier on them and take the heat off of them. So you got to always be careful about stuff like that because I had to learn the hard way. I had to learn the hard way on stuff like that. Even when I said, okay, I'm going to mind my own business. I'm just going to be, you know, be quiet, whatever. And it's just be stuff like that happens. And we just have to understand the things like the situations we're in right now. It's just a jump start to something better. And that's how you have to tell yourself you're in a jump start for something better. You want to have your own business, especially with empaths. <laughs> especially with empaths we do not like rules we do not like regulations even though we we have our own rules and we have our own boundaries you know we have rules for a reason you know rules for jobs you know even though that mess might not not make no daggone sense to us you know there's rules for reasons you know they always say that we make rules for reasons and i'm just like you know what you just trying to control somebody because some of this stuff don't make any kind of sense to me. This just seems like you want to be able to have that upper hand on somebody. And I already see you are not about to do that with me. But go ahead. We'll, we'll go ahead. And <laughs> we'll play this role with you today. But it's just, you when you know you're in a place you want you don't want to be, you know it's going to have to take work for you to get out of that place you don't want to be. You put it up, no, number one, you put it up to the universe. I'm not going to be at this job too long. You know, I'm not saying I want to get fired or whatever like this, but I'm going to work my darndest, you know, to get myself on that level where I want to be at. You start finding places that you want to be. You know, if you got folks out there you can talk to, you, you know, you know, you got to get you a game up. You got to have you a game plan. So when you know you, I mean, it's just your motivation and it gets hard, but then you got to think about it. Yeah, this situation is hard right now, but the situation you in right now should motivate you to get to something better. That's all it's going to do because you know God is not when God knows that he know when he knows that you can apply a lot more for yourself and I have to learn that for myself too. He he will knock stuff out your life. He will put stuff on hold. You could be waiting for some money to come in and I'm telling you, you know, one of my girls, they know what I'm talking about. They don't put blocks and holes on every daggone thing just when they want you to just sit down and listen to what we got to say just just listen to the signs pay attention to the stuff that we're sending you pay attention to the stuff around you you know and it was just things that were coming into my life and i was really you know relating to it you know resonating with all those things that were going on with myself and i just all i had to do is just listen because i'm just like God, I can't deal with this no more. When I finally figured out, okay, well, we were just going to wait until you try to stop figuring this out on your own. <laughs> we were trying to help you, but, you know, you have to get yourself into that point where if it ne if it needs to be, meditate. If you're trying to figure out things and, you know, we don't we can't do everything on our own, even though we try to, we can't do everything on our own, but when you're on that mission and you know you're on you're on that verge that jump start you know you you know you about it, it it's just like when we go through things it's like our blessings are like slingshots we're all in those slingshots and it's just the more junk we go through the more we get pressed back because the more we we tend to be able to stand strong and just say, hey, you're not going to disrespect me or, hey, I'm not going to look, you're stepping over boundaries or, hey, you know, you step in your foot now, you stand in your ground. You're doing what you need to do to make sure you, you're you're straight. When the universe sees that, you know, next thing you know, that daggone thing shot gets let go, guess what? 
all it can do is just go back. And then when he lets go, it's just going to go flying forward. And that's what it's going to be for you. And you have to really just look at the situation you're in at that point. Don't complain about the situation you're in. God knows that you don't want to be there. But that's the reason why he got it to that point where, you know what, if I guarantee you, if I put <clears throat> Lucy right here or Bobby right here in this situation or rattle this situation up real, real quick, either he going to sink or he going to find his way to swim. And that's the reason why things happen that way, because sometimes the universe stirs stuff up just because they know we are capable of doing a lot more than what we're supposed to be doing if we put that effort and we work hard for the things that we want. And we, when we put it out to the universe and actually apply ourselves towards what we're trying to work on, oh, shoot, they, they have no problem with helping you then. They'll bring the stuff that you need. That I like with me. When I say I want to go ahead and be this motivational speaker, and there'll be days I'll have a brain fart, y'all, and try to figure out, okay, what's my next video? Because there's days, like I said, there's days I'll come out with two or three videos, and there's some days I'll come out with one. It just depends on how things, how how my downloads are set up. <laughs> so when I talk about things, I talk about things when things drop in my lap or things come at me or there's something I'm learning for the day that you might be going through too. So just know when you're on that jump start, it your jump start can just branch you off to very extraordinary things. You know, you just have to apply yourself and don't give up. And just know that anything you want in life and you want it badly enough, they're going to try to see how bad you want it and you know it's never going to be easy. So hopefully, uh, I'm hoping that you got something out of this video that, you know, it really was speaking to you. I hope that, you know, you, you don't be a stranger. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. I love the chance to hear from you. Drop me a line. I love the chance to know you about the knows you, knows you. Lord Jesus, help me know you as much as you're getting to know me. I say, allow me to retort and come back and say that again. <laughs> love to get a chance to know you as much as you're getting to know me you dropping a line even if it's about positive feedback or it's just about your spiritual gift long as it's possible po positive is all welcome y'all don't mind me it's late at night and I'm tired it's been a long day and I'll see y'all later. Much love to you. Remember, you are always loved and you are blessed and highly favored. And stay prosperous. Send out as much love and light as possible. And positivity is possible. And I'll see you on the next video. <laughs> Peace and be wild.